place is really informal. It's like a bar without like without selling alcohol, so it's like music is loud, which is good. It keeps certain people away. <laughs> I get all the free pizza I can eat. So when I run out of money, I eat tons. I still eat tons of pizza. I love it. I really like our pizza a lot. I mean, sometimes I eat like three slices, like, and it's like while I'm working, in like four hours. And a lot of people I do kick out and stuff. I still like 86. A lot of people. I have like a list. Brackets. Definitely. They, they just come in and like dance in the store. Guys like pass out. You're like. Don't even want to touch them. They have to like slowly move them out. Between them and like the bridge and tunnel people, like like last night these other kids came in. They're all like wasted. They're like, "Do you know where any bars are around here?" It's like, "Dude, yes." And they're like, "Can we get? We're looking for crank." Like, uh, sorry, we don't sell any crank. You can probably find some. <laughs> There's so many people that, that repeatedly. Yeah. come in here and threaten us with physical harm. <laughs> yeah. but for the most part, this whole area, the pizza store is good, but the whole area is totally going downhill. We're going uphill in a bad way. It's becoming more yuppie-ish. Like employees and everything have gotten more serious just because the customers have gotten more, like, more assholes than ever. <laughs> They're trying to clean up the area, but I don't know. I don't know if they can. We do a lot of business, but it's fucking at a price.